Alrighty, what is going on guys, and welcome back to The Witcher 3. Back again. We're going to follow the Baron in the last one. We killed all of his guys. Oh, shit. I pity any bastard who's hurt her. I'm flying alive. Here it is. Damn it! Jammed again. Bedchamber. Tamara's room is there. Alrighty. I'll try not to make a mess. For their return, I want everything to be as they left it. What can I take stuff off though? Wooden candlestick. Stems broken. Cool. Maybe I won't take stuff from his room just yet. Fresh flowers. He expects them to return any minute. Takes hope. I feel like if I take stuff, I'm going to get told off, and I've already, you know, kind of fucked this guy over a bit too much, I think. <laughs> Walls a different color. Something used to hang here. Hmm. That painting? Right size. Well, that's it. The Baron and his wife. <laughs> Look happy enough. What's this? Ah, gotta wonder who wanted to hide the hole. And what's on the other side. A cupboard. Hmm. It gets interesting. Piece of wood looks like the stem of that candlestick. No coincidence there. Hmm. Fight might have happened here. I'll look for clues. A fight? Oh. Deep nicks, hit with a heavy object. Huh. Rest of the candlestick and wine stains. Somebody smashed a bottle from Toussaint. Yeah, Ervalus. Scent hasn't died. Wonder where it'll lead me. Why is that it? Take anything from that. Oh, so now I've got to follow this. Okay. Could use some hair of the hound. Got any vodka? Damn, trail breaks off. Could find something else though. Hmm, spruce wood. Smells of juniper incense. Some sort of folk talisman. Protective. Question is. Against what? Won't find much else here. You white oh. one. Look like you got done poking around. Whole landing smells of wine. Tell me anything about that? One of the lads must be. Lushes one and all. Give your men air valus. Oh damn it. I might have spilled it. I told you I was good and marinated that night. Was it matter? Stench of wine in plenty of corn around the castle. Found signs of a fight in the room. Know anything about that? A fight? What are you talking about? Someone was attacked. Probably your wife or daughter. Whoever it was tried to defend themselves with a candlestick. Missed the attacker. Punctured the wall instead. They tussled too. I... I don't know nothing about this. That night, I was drunk. Don't remember a thing. They were gone by the time I awoke. Doubt you were the only ones in the castle. Maybe one of your men heard something? Three times I asked those bastards if they'd seen anything, heard anything. Nothing! Not a one of them! Recognize this amulet? Hmm. Yes. Anna began wearing it a time ago. Any idea where she got it? None. Any witches or cunning women in the area? A Pella. 
Old Coop lives near Blackbow. And there's a cunning woman in Midcops, but I know little about her. She's only recently arrived. If Anna were to see someone, she'd choose the Pella, not the woman. Anna was wary of strangers, newcomers. Want to have a chat with this Pella? Fair warning, he's a hard man to talk to. Rumor has it he killed his own father with an axe as a lad, then went batty. Now they say he sees ghosts and plows his goat. Not really interested in his hobbies. Just want to ask about the amulet. Do some hair of the hound. Got any vodka? Plows his goat. Lovely. Don't judge. Don't knock it till you've tried it. Or is that a thing? So Siri was here. Uh huh. If we stick all this stuff in here for now, because we're not going to use any of it, are we? What's this? Odd. Yeah, I don't want to use that. Runestone. Chance to cause burning. I just stick most of this in here for now. Just so I've got space. I'm hoping the stash is kind of endless. And I'm actually going to take out that axe in case mine breaks. And then I suppose whenever we get to it, I can just... Uh... Oh, I can... Um... What did you call it? Come back and pick it up if you want to sell it. The Natural Obscurity of Curses by Lydia Van Bredevoort. Where'd Siri get this? A spinning top. Gritka's toy. What is that it? Siri must have used these. Looks like she left in a hurry. Oh, I didn't even know we had another quest. Find the witch on your own or in the residence of Midcops. Okay. God, I'm so clueless. Right. I need to get better with the combat. I think if I get better with the combat, I'll be a bit happier. Oh, is this guy selling shit? Fancy a gander at our little stockpile. We've sure. gathered ourselves quite the collection. Why let such nice things waste away in peasants' halls? Show me what you got. That sells for a bit. I'll keep them books because I get feeling I'm going to need them for something. Of Guardian saddlebags. Neil Guardian stuff. So if it's yellow, does that mean it's legendary? I don't know. Of Guardian crossbow. Or just a better crossbow than our one. It's only 48. Okay. That'll do. See ya. Because I think our crossbow is a bit shit. Take them. I'll take quests. Oh shit, I should have watched that. 
Place of interest. Every important location you discover will be marked. To jump, to press L3, to scroll, L. Yep. Here you can see objectives you are currently... Yep. So what's this? Undiscovered. Get a boat. Find the palace hut. Oh, what's this? Bandit camp. Ooh. All right. I'll finish this quest, and then we'll go and uh, go and do that. Go and do those contracts. Or try. Does it give you a level on them? Because I don't want to be doing. See, that's level. Series room. Oh, okay. Level 8. Okay, we'll leave that one for now. But we could do the witch one. Mid cops. Where is mid cops? Oh. We'll get there. The guy in there, you selling like food and stuff? Spot a cider for you? Or a bit of dry curd? Me lad, it's not exactly burst him, but what I got, sure to please. Like to take a look. The size of his arms. Saddlebags. Why oh, stuff so expensive? Buy all oh, five. Yeah, that'll do. And we'll do that as well. Farewell. Oh, there we go. Where's my horsey? Got that horse's whip like a noble lad whore. You surprised? They tried to dance with a witcher. Where'd he come from anyway? Well, how should I know? You're so curious. Ask him to see. Do I have a. Oh, it's already on him. Faster. Come on, only. Peasant. Help an old feeble woman. What's wrong? To their night blasphemers, pups taken profane the shrine to Verna the Merciful. The shrine's gotta be repaired, else Verna will take umbrage. Their cows will croak, the kitties will be covered in warts, and our dogs will get the mange. Warts and mange? Sounds dangerous. Fine, I'll help you. Have sent ye to me, someone to repair their shrines from this day on. Look, already got a trade. I'm a witcher, restoring traditional roadside structures in wood. Just not my specialty. Fight evil, that's a witcher's calling. And vandals are worse than beasts. Fine, I see any damaged shrines. I'll take care of them. Won't go out of my way though. 
Nothing's out of the way in these parts, and the gods will guide ye. That'll do, I guess. Points of interest. The world is brim of interest in place filled with danger or treasure. Sights are guard on your mini map. Dungeon monster nest. Person in distress. Spoils of war. Smugglers cached. Guarded treasure. Ooh. Why are you telling me there's a, gu a place here? Yeah, I fuck off. Bandit camp. Uh, we could try it. I don't know if I'm going to be high enough to do it. It also depends how many of them are in it. Faster. How do I... At what level they are. Seven. Go for the horse, son's eye. Ow. Shut up and fight. This crossbow does so much more damage. Ow. Horsey, go! Got the wrong sword out. Yes! Oh my god, yes. Oh, no, I didn't want to press that. Oh, this guy's getting in next because he's pissing me off. Fuck off. You fucking... Oosh. Yeah. No, no, why did I press that? I didn't want to press that. He <laughs> of guard longsword. Arch Griffin. He got fucking wrecked. That's not what I wanted to press, but I'll do. He <laughs> anything else in there I can take? Oh, I'm proud of that. So we're getting it. I just got to time the the blocks because that's what I struggle with. I'm proud of that one. Is that a wolf? That's a deer. I got like snipe one. I'm snipe this one. Ah, oh, I missed. So I reckon I can go and take out that other one now. That other camp that I struggled with last time. That's it, Roach. Oh, I can sell all this shit to this guy. Hey, 
Hey, Merchant. Show me what you've got on offer. Can I sell everything to you? Not that they're really worth. That's got a bit of damage on it. Well, that's got plus eight. Oh shit. Plus 18. That'll do. So long. So that said, that axe was better than mine. Plus 11. Plus 15. So how much does that do? 51. 55. Oh shit. Okay. Are you bad guys? Oh no, what's going on here? What do you want? Want to talk to the Peller? Too late. We've got dibs on a chat with him. A long one. Oh, shit. What do you want from him? To give him what he deserves. And that is? He done conjured Alkiris. Said something evil had made its nest in Edric's bowels. Told Edric to eat rowan berries. Lots of them. Ever since Edric's lived in the outhouse. And he's got hardened pustules all over him. Um. How much? Maybe we can make a deal. We'll not plow in bargain with no one. Vengeance. That's what we want. Just so happens I need the Peller alive. So if you agree to leave him alone for good, I'm willing to tell you how to help Edric. Who the hell do you think you are? A Witcher. A Witcher? Hear that, boys? Either Velen's got a bumper crop of witches, or this is the bastard who cut down our boys at the crossroads. Bad idea. Oh, shit. Aha! Come back. Go with you. About a man who could get Edric's friends all worked up. Take all this shit as well. I hopefully it doesn't come back on me because I like I didn't want to do that. I actually tried not to. Hey, anybody home? Open up, it's safe now. Devils. Who do they bring? What seek ye? I need your help. Whoa. A man. Nay, a wolf. Grey. Though not old. Tis he the Peller awaits. You were expecting me. I, As the bones declared I should. They shall come whose stench is rape and death, but the wolf shall disperse them, the white wolf. And thus he comes. Omens never lie. Recognize this. Made of spruce wood, strong smell of juniper, designed to protect someone. Freshly cut spruce sprinkled with goat's blood, then tempered with an incense of earth smoke and juniper. For Anna to protect her. You make the amulet? Aye, sure it was the Pella. After the way of his forefathers over still water in the light of a full moon. Proper as amulets go. It protected well. Should never have taken it off. So, designed to protect her. From what? Oh, the dear. Besieged she was, evil all around, wanting to possess her. Old magic born of oblivion, from dark sources emerged. 
old magic. Can you be more specific? It is not for mouth speech, nor for the touch. A small protective charm, not a thing more Appella could do. Anna and her daughter are missing. Know where they are? Nay, no, nay. Pella don't know. But the spirits could know. The Pella will augur, the spirits ask. Spirits? Great. Fine with me. As long as I know where to look, where to find them. Lost, lost, must be found. Princess! None better than princess for finding things. Princess? Which princess? Princess! My goat! She's fled! Those men must have scared her off. Can we get back to the auguring? Nope, gotta fetch a goat. Without the goat? Impossible. No goat? <laughs> Won't work. Will you help me if I bring the goat back? Princess! Princess! Where have you got to, girl? Fine. I'll get your goat. The bell. The little bell's ringing. She loves it. Ring, ring, and she will follow. But for a while. But beware of wild strawberries. Raspberries, too. Yeah, treacherous as beasts go. I always keep an eye out for them. <laughs> oh, shit. Following a goat. Uh, that's stench. Nope. This axe goes in. This way, I think. I wanted to do. Just another clue. Ah. Goat. Here, princess. This one. Hoofed and horned. Should have known it would be stubborn. <laughs> All right. Time to try the bell. I'm trying it. Come on. Let's go see the bell. There. Come on, damn it. What are you going that way for? Where the hell do you go? Bear, bear, run, you stupid piece of shit. Oh, shit. No. Peasy. You got wrecked. Oh, what's in here then? A dead goat. Deer. It's not a goat, it's a deer. Maybe I'll uh, do that when I've not got a goat to. Uh, do I really have to keep ringing this bell for you to follow? <laughs> I 
Actually, that does remind me quick. Because I've just used all that potion. Oh, it won't let me. Arch Griffin. Oh. Doesn't matter then. Princess. Flee not from the Pella, for there are wolves about. <laughs> goat of mine, dearest, sweetest goat. Tomorrow now, know where they might be. Blood, we need blood, a living being. Fine, be right back. Excuse me. a child. Whose? Why, Anna's. Anna was pregnant? She was. And she miscarried. Hmm. Baron didn't mention it. Afraid, perhaps. Or ashamed, or forgetful. Or perhaps he had no wish to remember. Did the Baron have anything to do with his wife's miscarriage? Foul-tempered he is, and he's a fondness for hooch. No doubt makes his temper even fouler. Did he abuse his family? Anna came to you. You must have noticed something. The Pella's old, near blind. But Princess came and licked her hand. So what? She's a wise beast. Only comes to those who suffer. What happened to the child? In a grave throne. Without rite or ceremony, it awoke. Now it wanders. It seeks vengeance. A botchling. White wolf. Wise wolf. Catch the botchling. The botchling will help. Lead the wolf to the loved ones. Botchlings suck the blood of pregnant women and eat their fetuses. They don't help. Tis a being cursed. And witches lift curses. If the white wolf can't lift it, he should bring me its blood. Blood will always find kindred blood. Oh, I like that episode where he turns that woman in this sort of natural witcher thing. who lifted a botchling's curse. Never tried it myself, though. I know you need to bury it under the threshold. And give it a name. Perform the I'm Roin. The ritual of naming. That's an elven custom. Human, elven, dwarven, ancient. Spirits have no race. They honor not its meaning. Win a spirit's favor, and the spirit shall aid you. Ask, and it will answer. 
Seek, and it will show you the way. Whatever I do, I gotta find the botchling first. Seek it at midnight, near the grave that lies empty. If what you say is true, the Baron ought to know where that grave is. For God's sake. Smash it. I'll tell you what, I'm going to cut and we'll be back when we get over there because that's a long way away. Oh, I miss that. Everything's on fire. What the fuck is going on? Something tells me it's a bit dodgy about him, isn't there? I knew a frost spell. Oswin, where's Oswin? Anyone seen him? Believe I saw him heading to the stable. What? Fire? You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? In that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable. We've got to save him. He'll burn alive. Him and the horses. See what I can do. Hurry now, quick! Talk to the Baron. <laughs> How am I supposed to, um... Save the stable hand. Damn it, won't budge. Probably bolted on the inside. Need oh, there's a ladder. The mud. Damn it, won't budge. Probably bolted on the inside. Need another way in. <laughs> Damn it, lots of smoke. Gotta hurry. The fuck are you supposed to hurry? Oh, want more fire on, do you? Coming to get you. Um, don't really know. Wait a minute. I'll just go through here. How do you open it? Ah. Well, that was nearly tragic, wasn't it? or after you beat her to a pulp. What the fuck are you suggesting? Don't play me for a fool. You'd been beating them for years. Finally, they'd had enough and fled. Sound about right? Ah! Oh! They Fist! Fight down. me! Oh. This guy... Oh, shit. Oosh, oosh. Ah, ow. Yeah, that's what happens. The shit kicked out of you. We need to talk. <laughs> I 
Yeah, like right this second, because this is when it's most important, obviously. Sit down. You beat them. I never laid a finger on Tamara. Not once. And on Anna. That's another story. She always knew how to spark my ire. Your wife. How'd she make you angry? Too much salt in the soup? Socks never darned? Twenty years we've known each other. She's seen me drunk and sober. She was there to greet me when I returned the victor. She was there to patch me up in defeat. Like no other, she knew where to press, where to pinch, so it would hurt. You beat her? For that? For criticizing you? Oh, Witcher, you haven't a clue, have you? Well, perhaps I shall tell you about it one day. One day, but not today. Expect me to believe you are a loving father to Tamara after that scene in the courtyard? You're free to believe whatever you wish, but she was always the apple of my eye. She had the run of the place, ask anyone. She'd ride the horses, hunt with the men, at times join them on their rounds. And they'd send for her when I flew into a rage, for only she could calm me. Make it sound like she led a charmed life. If that's the case, why'd she run? I'd hardly need you if I knew. You knew they had run away from the start. Yes, I knew. Why didn't you tell me? Wasted my time. Say I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? Tell me everything you remember about the day they fled. The truth this time. I'd been soaking myself three days straight. Anna came to me, said they were leaving. I begged them to stay. She refused to hear it. I tried to stop her. She wriggled like an eel. We struggled. She fell. Last Blasted thing I remember. Woke up in the morn, breeches heavy with my own piss. A large bump on my head. Sadly, they were gone. Know what that's like, Witcher? No. How the fuck could you? I was left with nothing. Nothing! Only the bottle. Tomorrow, present for all this, she see you quarrel. Through the doorway, perhaps. She didn't enter the room. Shame, too. Things might have turned out differently. The sight of her always calmed me. Signs of a fight in the room. Hole in the wall, wine all over the landing. Was that you? I. We tussled. She tried to whack me on the noggin with a candlestick, but kept missing. Hit the wall and the pillar instead. I staggered backwards onto the table, spilled the wine, slipped and tumbled. Anna used that moment to flee. She rushed down the stairs, still clutching that damn candlestick. I caught her on the landing. We fell. I, I thought I had her. Then she turned and smacked me in the head. I blacked out. I don't know what happened next. When I came to, I was alone. What happened next? Next? It only got worse. I awoke at sunset, not knowing how many days had passed. Thought it was all a plowing, drunken nightmare. And then I went to the bedchamber, and Anna was not there. Instead, there was blood everywhere. I knew she'd miscarried. My breath short, my throat locked. I neared the bed and saw it. It lay there, a tiny thing, 
defenseless, on bloodied sheets, dead. And it was my doing. Maybe you're doing, maybe not. But that amulet she wore could be important. Or maybe the fact that she lost it. What did you do with the child? What was I to do? Took it out and buried it. Just like that? Damn you! I gave no thought to a funeral. It was a horror. I wanted it to end. That child had been my dream. I told Anna, the little one, our little one, to make things right. Yet she died before she could be born. Understand, Witcher. My child was dead. Get hold of yourself. Men like you, when they break down, look downright pathetic. You're a heartless bastard. <laughs> Mutations worked then. But here's the good news. Your dead child might help us find the one who's still alive. And your wife. What? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into... fucking what? <laughs> yeah. Exactly. That's, that's what I'm thinking right now. <laughs> A cursed creature that draws strength from killing pregnant women. Once it's strong enough, it attacks those who scorned it. But how? How does it know? Blood ties. They're a strong bond. A bond I want to use to find your family. How? One of two ways. Legends claim you can bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual, and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob. A guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. And the other way? We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. Do not kill my child. It's suffered enough already. Lift the curse that it may finally rest in peace. Still not sure what to do. Whatever you decide, we must put an end to my child's suffering. Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her, and I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubberkin, they can bury us in it. Handy either way. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Get word to the common folk. Let us stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. And try to sober up. Do I take a shovel to dig up the grave? Take it. You'll need it, but not for that. So I can fucking whack you in the forehead with it. It'll be a candlestick this time. What the? A bit further. Follow me. This took a really dark turn for the worst, didn't it? I wasn't expecting this, I'll be honest with you. But on that note, I'm going to have to end this one there. Uh, things are certainly um, interesting, for sure. <laughs> so if you guys have enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. It's been your boy, and I will uh, see you in the next one.